All right, as they say in the South, are y'all ready for barbecue shrimp and grits? The most important thing when you're cooking these grits is to whisk constantly, because you don't want them to be lumpy. When you can start to see the lines of the whisk kind of remain in the grits, then you kind of know they're thick enough. You don't want to let them cool while you're cooking the shrimp, because they will clump up. So you can actually hold them and a low simmer for half an hour to an hour. Now I have this vegetable trinity of scallions, red bell peppers, and green bell peppers. We want a medium to high heat in the pan. These are gonna cook down probably a good five minutes. And then I'm gonna add my shrimp and creole spice. So the creole spice is one of my favorite spice blends. We have toasted cumin seeds, Herb de Provence, then we've got sweet paprika and cayenne pepper. This is a spicy spice blend. Black pepper and salt. So I mix those all together and this is what the mixture looks like. Just want to cook them until they have a nice sear. You're not going to cook them all the way through like this. And then we add the Creole sauce. Barbecue Creole sauce is the name of it, but it's a reduction of Worcestershire light beer scallions, and garlic. And let the shrimp cook in that liquid for a little while. Then I add some cream. A little butter to finish the sauce. And a squeeze of fresh lemon juice. At the end, I like to add a little fresh spinach in it so I can pretend that it's low-cal. A little fresh parsley on top to finish and enjoy it.